Lilibet Diana is set to make her first visit to the UK and meet the Queen when Prince Harry and Meghan Markle make a trip across the pond in spring, according to a royal expert. The Queen could be set to meet her great-granddaughter Lilibet Diana for the first time with Prince Harry and Meghan Markle planning a UK return this year. During an interview with Pod Save the Queen podcast host and gripper, royal commentator Russell Myers claimed that the Sussexes could make the trip across the pond in spring for some of Harry's projects. Myers explained, It's been a busy year and it probably is a good time to let this year go, see what happens in the new year and hopefully we will see them back in the UK. Because Harry has got the Invictus Games, fingers crossed, in May slash June, so one would assume he will come back and see his family. And again, one would assume Meghan will come to the Invictus Games as well, with the children. So, I think that that's probably a fair bet to say that we may see them in the springtime next year. But who knows? We all know how much Meghan and Harry love to cash in on their royal connections. Baby Lily's name is just that, a tie to the institution they were so desperate to get away from. So, why name their daughter after the head of the firm whom they claimed made racist comments towards an unborn Archie? Harry and Meghan are doing all they can to make themselves look and feel important when they're losing an uphill battle. After all Prince Charles has been looking at slimming down the monarchy for years and it has nothing to do with his wayward younger son and daughter-in-law. Meghan and Harry have been using their titles for commercial gain. They just can't seem to get it through their heads that M.M. isn't a great actor and Harry couldn't get into Sandhurst without help. The only reason he got in was because of his station in life as Her Majesty's grandson. With Meghan's children's book coming out and already falling down the bestseller list quicker than anyone can keep track, they've only got themselves to blame. We know that Prince Charles adores his grandchildren. He has allegedly only seen Archie twice since his birth in 2019. There's the prospect that he could never meet Lily which is just horribly sad. His son is being spiteful and for what? Because he was told he couldn't have what he wanted when he had been given everything he has ever asked for leading up to being told no? The newest members of the British royal family were mentioned in Queen Elizabeth's 2021 Christmas broadcast. The 95-year-old monarch welcomed four new great-grandbabies this year. Princess Eugenie's first child, August, was born in February, followed by Zara's son in March. Meghan and Harry's little girl, who was named after the Queen, was born in June, while the newest royal family member, Sienna, arrived in September. After learning that Prince Harry will be releasing a memoir, Markle allegedly started contemplating writing her own book. However, the Duchess of Sussex will decide whether to push through with the plan or not after the release of her husband's memoir. She's waiting to gauge the reaction to Harry's memoir first, the unnamed source said. Speaking of Prince Harry's memoir, the unnamed source claimed that it will be filled with bombshells that will surely rock the royal family. The book will be controversial, with a lot of bombshells about royal life and mistreatment. As for the couple's Spotify and Netflix partnerships, they will also, allegedly, release multiple projects this year. Their Spotify channel will release some podcasts. There will also be two new Netflix documentary series. One about Harry's work following athletes to compete in the Invictus Games and another one about the couple's humanitarian work. This will give the public a real look into their lives for the first time since they left the UK.